Hey guys, quick update. First of all, I wanna thank Brenda McGeary or Fifth Page uh, 13 for the awesome intro. You probably saw it then on uh, the TF2 videos I uploaded. If not, that uh, you probably haven't watched them. <laughs> but anyway, you probably got a chance to see it at the beginning of this episode if I remember to actually add it during the rendering. Which it probably will since I'll just render this as soon as I stop filming. Anyway, um, so huge thanks to Brandon for that. Second of all, I want to apologize to everyone who was expecting a Modern Blade or Binding of Isaac let's play. I just can't get those two games to work properly. Modern Blade keeps on randomly lagging at some point while filming it, which is extremely infuriating. So. Yeah. Uh, and uh, as for the fighting of Isaac, it just doesn't work with traps in Camtasia, just makes lag. Weirdly enough. Especially considering the fact that I don't have any problems running any of my other games at all. Um, but on the bright side, they're both those Let's Plays are going to be replaced with this. Kingdoms, the Kingdoms of MLR Reckoning, a brand new game developed by EA, available on the PS3, yeah, Xbox 360, and the, obviously the PC. I'll be doing a let's play of this, and I'm quite sure some of you guys will enjoy it. Simply because I'm going to enjoy the hell out of it. It's just way too much fun. I mean, it somehow managed to make its way up to my top 5 games of all time, which is quite a prestigi uh, prestigious list, considering all the games I have played. It's... Uh, it's definitely above Oblivion, funnily enough. And definitely above Mass Effect and uh, Fallout. And definitely above Dragon Age, I just don't really like Dragon Age. At all. The entire series. I don't really like it. Um, but it's probably... It's probably just below Borderlands. And my favorite games ever. Well, my top five games. Which is a list composed of Borderlands, World of Warcraft, Minecraft. Uh... Tales of Vesperia and uh, Black and White. That's it. Black and White one. I know. Huge, very prestigious list. Also, let's not forget about the fact that I don't play World of Warcraft. Well, not anymore. I'm not that excited about Minecraft as I used to be. Uh, Black and White is a really old game, and I've played it. Sh I played the shit out of it, and unless they release some kind of new update or some modders create a new awesome mod, I probably would not actually. Like, that's not. It's not gonna stay in the top uh, five list that any longer. And for as for Borderlands, yeah, I've only started playing it playing that recently as well and I just love it it's really addictive like this one uh, what makes this game so great the combo I don't know I just love the combat system I mean it's obviously not realistic but screw realism if I wanted realism I wouldn't be playing video games in the first place now would I well, I mean, I, or I would be playing something as stupid as Call of Duty or Battlefield. Which, in case you didn't know, suck. I hate most shooters like that, to be honest. I hate, obviously hate uh, Battlefield 3 and Call of Duty, but I also hate Halo, for example. Um, Counter-Strike... I mean, the only sh actual competitive shooters I do like are Team Fortress 2 and uh, Half-Life Deathmatch. 
not really know of any, of any other shooters except the Call of Duty series and the Battlefield series and the Halo series. That's pretty much it. Counter Strike doesn't really count. Hey, that. Okay, that didn't really count. Okay. Anyway. Uh, what else do I want to talk to you guys about? I guess we'll just scroll around the menu quickly just to give you a faint idea of how the game kind of is. Besides the awesome combos. Uh, oh yeah! The freelancer let's play. I managed to completely finish that, but I started over again because I'm using this new mic. Okay, it's not a new mic, it's an old karaoke mic. That I'm supposed that I'm supposed to be using what you know karaoke. Ow. God dang it. I hate these guys, they're so annoying. Anyway, uh, I know the, the new mic sounds good, so yeah, don't even try to lie about it. It sounds awesome, and I'm extremely happy about it. <laughs> so you guys, I've been using a crappy, almost completely broken mic before. The only problem I have with this mic is that I kind of have to improvise on holding that place. Because, well, it's a... God dang it! Get, get away from me! Uh, because obviously it's a karaoke mic, it's like a normal microphone, except it's not normal. As you just plug it in, plug it in, it looks like a complete normal microphone, etc. etc. So, anyway, I kind of had to improvise with that, and the result is quite ridiculous, I might say. I'm using a Pringles box to hold it in place and doesn't move. You can probably see it on uh, the Twitter feed. I posted a picture with it. But it's the only thing I could have, could have done to make it, you know, see that to at least seem good. Also, I apologize for my sniffling guy. Kind of caught a cold. Um, anyway. Ooh, 100% fate. Good to know. Uh, anyway, that's pretty much it for the update. I don't think there's anything else I need to add. Thanks again to uh, Brandon for the awesome intro. And I guess I'll see you guys. Wow, I fell on that one. Anyway, I guess I'll see you guys later.